To save money, I'll deliver the baby myself. A fallen tree destroyed the nursery and nearly killed me. You saved money on a pro and cut the tree yourself, and you didn't finish. We withdrew our child's college fund to repair the house. But Todd spent all the money on a Ferrari. It's my right. It was my birthday. Here's a cent. You'll save more. Todd had made me save every penny for a stupid car. I only rebelled once when I helped a man who'd been robbed. He doesn't need to go to the airport. He wants to get drunk, dummy. The man was a doctor on his way to perform a life-saving surgery. He transferred twice as much money as I gave him to my account. My kindness paid off, but Todd got jealous and took away my phone. I went into labor and there was no gas in my car. Todd drove it instead of his Ferrari and didn't fill up. Don't you dare. Your water will break and you'll get it dirty. I couldn't call an ambulance either. It was too expensive. You're not in labor yet. You can still take the subway. I was having contractions when the subway car went off the rails. We hit a wall and the train blocked the exit. As everyone was panicking, my water broke. I expected Todd to help me, but he passed out from fright. Rescuers cleared the debris while Todd threw a tantrum. I prayed and asked my baby to wait. I was in for a scary experience until I had a fateful meeting. Here we are again. Don't worry, I'll deliver your baby. No, he's a doctor so he'll bill us later. I'll deliver the baby myself. But then the roof collapsed in the back of the car. Save me. Get me out, I'm too young to die. Don't worry, it'll be fine. I would never charge you. I saw an opening Todd immediately tried to climb through. He didn't care about my screams or the fact that I was about to give birth. The baby isn't in the right position. We need to get out now. Todd got stuck, blocking my path to salvation. But Alex and the crowd pushed him through, then helped me. I heard Todd scream about suing over some scratches. I had my baby in the ambulance with the doctor's help. I had a partner delivery. Without my husband. Todd demanded the ICU for scratches and a tetanus shot. When I filed for divorce, I found out he'd been lying to me for years. Judging by his taxes, his income was much higher. And I got exactly half of what I should have owned earlier. Alex met us at the hospital with a bouquet. My daughter and I finally had a real man by our side. My ex took out a loan so he wouldn't have to sell his precious Ferrari. I wish that tree would wreck your whole house. Karma really works, and I didn't feel sorry for him at all. Do you believe in karma and fateful encounters? Share your stories.